All right, we want to solve the inverse secant of 2 root 3 over 3. So um, this is the same thing. Uh, if we make this the cosine, or excuse, well, secant's 1 over cosine. So if we just reciprocate this to be like the cosine, that way we can interpret it better and get it on the unit circle. It's equal to 3 over 2 root 3 cancels out and we end up with root 3 over 2 for the cosine so we're bound between negative or excuse me that's not correct we're bound between 0 and pi so where does it equal where does cos where does cosine equal root 3 over 2 and therefore the secant because the secant's going to be um, 2 over root 3 and then we got to rationalize it so this is pi, the 30 degrees, or pi over 6. So the solution to this problem is just pi over 6. And like I said, the whole reason I use the cosine is because it allowed me to see it better. It's a little bit harder if you use a secant. But like I said, if you do the secant, then it's the hypotenuse over the adjacent. So 2 over root 3, and then you rationalize, and then you get 2 root 3 over 3. All right, pi over 6 is the solution. Hope that helps.